here in what we're going to call, I guess, the Rotunda Bennett's Mill Middle School. It's been under construction for a year and a half, since January 6th, I believe, is when they did the first grading. And um, now we're going to let the teachers start constructing. So if you look around the school, you'll see excellence under construction. We're just getting started. Um, you asked me about myself. I'm Ray Presley King, and this is my 12th year in Fayette County. I taught at, Fayette, at Flat Rock for three years, and I was a teacher at Booth for one year, and the rest of my time has been administrative time. I did have some time overseas in between. Uh, this is a dream come true. I'll tell you how much of a dream it is. Before, I always look into the future six years. I can't look into the future, this is what I want to do. So I have no idea where I'm going from here, but this is what I want to do. So. Oh, this is wonderful. So you must be very excited to have her as a principal we're here excited. and we're to have the school. We're very excited and we're very proud of her accomplishments already. She's already gotten off to a great start, hired a great staff, has her website up and operating, has a PTO up and going. So we're very proud of all that. Well, we're standing here in the rotunda, as she said, and we have a lot of natural light in the building. It's beautiful. You, you don't really need the lights on when the sun's out. And there's high technology in all the classrooms. We're very excited about that. And we're just excited for the students to be able to come to a brand new school to set the traditions. They were involved in helping set the name, the Broncos. That's right. The Bennisville Broncos. So they've already had a hand in it, and we're just ready to go. This is one of our PE um, teachers, and she's a new, brand new teacher to Fayette yeah, County, brand new teacher. And um, we have four teachers that will actually work in this room, and uh, they'll rotate in the connections class. The most about our science rooms is they actually are graphite tables instead of that composition type table. They're actually a graphite table. And so um, when they brought them in, I was really excited because they're really heavy. We don't have to worry about a lot of damage, a lot of scratching. We have, as of today, 523 students from schools throughout the county. We have our main feeder schools are Whitewater Middle, Booth Middle, and Fayette Middle. And our main elementary feeders are Cleveland, uh, Crab Apple, and Spring Hill. But we do have students from other schools that are coming in, trickles of them, but for the most part, those are the six feeders. And we feed into Whitewater High, Fayette High and Macintosh High. And we have a few that will go to Sandy Creek High. Okay? This is a teacher from Fayette Middle. And when I walked in here, I was just thrilled to see her Broncos. If you look up, she spelled Broncos using the elements, using from the <laughs> element table. Isn't that neat? Ray, how many teachers do you have? Right now, our staff is about 64 total. And it looks like about 49, I think it's 49 to 50 teachers. Now some of them are para pros, and some of them are actual teachers that are working on team. And we have connections teachers, PE teachers, music teachers, fine arts teachers. So we've got quite a few teachers. When I first saw this room on the internet before I even applied for a job, I thought this was the gym. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, I thought, wow, a gym with a stage. <laughs> <laughs> Then I walked to the school and I'm like, wow, there's a gym. And the projectors, if you look up at the top, there are two projectors. And the projectors will project on either side of the stage. So during performances, they can also show slideshows, any multimedia that they need to. And they'll also be tied into the internet and to the um, Richardson system that's going to broadcast throughout the school. Are there screens there? Are yeah, the screens will come down push a remote, the screens come down, and then we can show video and watch slideshows and things like that. I think it'll be a lot of fun. So are we going to be able to be in our own school instead of borrowing someone else's? Yes, ma'am. That is wonderful. Yes, ma'am. In other words, we won't have to go to another school to have a chorus um, okay. performance. And the band will be able to perform and we'll have a stage and all right here. That's good. That's great. Right. That is fantastic. This is the chorus room. And actually, Madeline is one of our chorus students. So she'll be up there quite a bit. Well, will you sing for us? <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> director and he's going to 
teach third period, is it, or second period? Uh, second period. Second period, he's going to teach fifth grade okay. band. And so is our orchestra teacher. They're going to actually walk over from Cleveland and have band here. That'll be nice. Isn't that neat? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's nice is that it's a kiln for her to use. This is Miss Raymer from um, Whitewater Middle. She's coming to us from Whitewater Middle and she's got a lot of new ideas. Are you a teacher here? I am. My name is Diana Caldwell, and I'm going to be teaching Connections Math for 6th, 7th, and 8th graders at Bennett's Mill. And how long have you been teaching? Uh, this is my 11th year in Fayette County. Long Where did time. you teach before here? I just finished seven years at Brooks Elementary, and then three years before that I taught at Rising Star Middle School. So I'm coming back to middle school after seven years on the elementary side. Okay. So very must, excited. I was going to say, it must be exciting being in a new school. It is. Everything's beautiful here and brand new and bright and clean and just all kinds of technology, and we're very, very excited. Proud to be a Bronco. <laughs> I will teach sixth grade reading and I'm thrilled to be here. Hi, my name is Joy Lamb and I'll be teaching seventh grade math and I'm very excited to be here also. Hi, my name is Pam Cramlick and I'll be teaching seventh grade social studies and I'm thrilled to be here. And I'm Kelly Stanford and I will be running a writing lab. Something new for me so I am excited and go Broncos! <laughs> Hi, I'm Barbara Knight. I'll be working with the special education students here at Bennett's Mill, and I'm thrilled to have, be here for this new year. Okay. How long have you been teaching? This will be my second year of teaching full-time in Fayette County. Where did you teach before this? Braylon Elementary. So okay. It's been a big change for me, but I'm really excited about it. Oh, great. Thanks. Thanks.